So, here I sit, uh, well, I am reclining, in bitter coldness, on vacation, and golly, am I enjoying myself. Um, not really, but heater is still going. It's on minimum at the moment. I expect negative zero temperatures tonight. Yeah, I got a light bulb. It's not charging properly. It's taking forever to charge, darn it. I was wondering if anybody out there, or everybody out there, remembers three years ago on the United States White House petition website. There was once a petition wherein people were asking the United States government to stop chemtrail spraying them. You know, chemicals being dumped on people from aircraft at 30,000 feet. You know, over the oceans, over the land, over the islands over little kids' swing sets and teeter-totters and stuff like that. They're just dumping chemicals, you know, chemtrails. For the government's own sinister, unguessed of agendas. <clears throat> so, of course, damn right, I signed it, did that petition asking the United States government to stop spraying us. But I also wanted to create a petition asking the government to keep spraying us. Maybe increase the chemtrail spray rate, you know, like maybe double the number of aircraft um, constantly in the sky chemtrail spraying us, you know. I bet, you know, hundreds of thousands of people might, you know, sign that petition. Please don't stop chemtrail spraying us. I think that would be pretty cool. Some people don't know it, but I actually went out and got a sample of chemtrail chemical. Um, on off of a chemtrail spraying 747. I actually had to kill five or six guards. I, I stopped counting around number four. Um, you know, I had, you know, several ways of eliminating, uh, you know, opposition. And after the first, you know, mowing down, I finally got on the aircraft and I got a sample of the chemical. And to my surprise, I ran the... Uh, analysis on the chemical, and I found that the chemical that they're spraying us has a uh, nitrogen atom bound to a uh, sulfur atom, and those are peptide bonded to a long series of 12 carbon atoms and 9 hydrogen atoms. So we have like C. 12 H9 N S for sulfur. And that's what they're spraying on us. And they're just dumping a shitload of that. You know, it's just like it's just raining down from the sky from hundreds of thousands of aircraft every day. They're just constantly dumping that on us. And I hope that they continue that. Every time I go outside, you know, I, I like breathe heavily and I do calisthenics because I want to make sure that the chemtrails are you know, fully infused in my lungs. Make sure it's got in every nook and cranny in my brain matter, you know, the gray stuff, the white stuff, and like the the membranes that cover, you know, the whole skull inside and stuff like that. And I'm kind of hoping it's also seeped into the marrow by now. It probably is. So that's what's in chemtrails, people. None of this idiotic heavy metals bullshit. That's just idiotic. I mean, it's not. It's carbon, hydrogen, nitrogen, sulfide um, in like 12 9 one, one ratio. That's what they are spraying on us. And I hope they continue.